To be an elite investor in this business, you have to master each market you cover. And I'm talking about knowing it like the back of your hand. I should be able to ask you all kinds of questions. Closing prices, rents, absorption, how much products on the market, how much sells per year. In this video, we're going to talk about the amount of geography you cover and how that has an effect on how successful you are in this business. Stick around. Let's go. This is a little segment that I cut out from George Roberts' The Foundry Multifamily Podcast that I was on recently. Take a listen. So is there any bad advice that you hear going around or maybe there's uh, some pitfall that you'd like to help investors avoid? I would say social media has created this atmosphere, and I mentioned this a little bit in my book, where it looks like people are closing on assets left and right. It looks like there are 300 deals per year done in every market of any type. I mean, there's just thousands and thousands of deals. Because when you go on LinkedIn, what happens is all investors are connected to who? Other investors. And so when you go on LinkedIn, you see this guy closing here and this guy closing here and this guy is doing a due diligence walkthrough and this guy is doing a pre-renovation pictures and this guy is showing his post-renovation pictures. And so your brain doesn't distinguish at least immediately until you hear me now telling you this on this podcast that these are transactions happening all over the country. But in any one market that a person invests in, there are very, very few transactions happening. As a matter of fact, in the entire northern half of Florida, not including Orlando and Tampa, but that's mostly where I transact. Gainesville, Ocala, Daytona, New Smyrna, Ormond, Jacksonville, St. Augustine, Tallahassee, Lake City, DeLand, Deltona, all these places combined, there's only about 130 to 140 deals a year done over 10 units. That's student, affordable, market rate, all that, 130, 140. That's like 12 transactions a month. Now, the reality is, is that of the deals that actually match what you, George, or any other investor, I have found that for the northern half of Florida, there's only one to two deals a month that actually match something you could ever have a shot at. So my biggest thing is you need to cover a large enough geography and be able to master the geography in order to buy the right number of units. Let me make sure you understand that. So it's not just, hey, I'm going to cover the entire Southeast United States. Well, if it's just three of you, there's no way you're going to master every market and every submarket in the entire Southeast United States. You're not, it's not going to happen. So you're going to be mildly good at a bunch of different markets. And that ain't good enough. You have to be rock solid, unbelievable Mensa type of stats on every market you cover. So if your brain capacity or your partnership capacity can only handle six markets, that's what you need to concentrate on. But you've got to cover enough in order to, when you calculate probabilities of winning those few deals that happen in all those markets combined is as high as possible. Thanks for giving that a listen. And if you've made it this far, go ahead. If you haven't already, give me a like down below. It helps me a tremendous amount with YouTube's algorithm. Make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell. And then you'll be made aware of all my videos that come out each week. See you guys on the next one.